Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and ironically, somebody sent me a puzzle they needed help with that was saved as a bitmap and wanted to know how to, and I, I mentioned in that deal that there's plenty of puzzle generators, jigsaw puzzle generators out there, and I am gonna put a link, because this might be one I've done before, but I've never seen this puzzle, where you could make your puzzle, you know, you can change different things and put a circle around it, put a, or circle warp it and, and save it as an SVG, SVG. And, you know, you can do the same thing up here. Um, you know, if you want it 10, you know, pieces by 10 pieces, uh, of course, then you need to change this back to 20 or 200, I mean. And you can limit the pieces. You can uh, limit the or change the curvature of the, the pieces. You can change the tab size. You can change the speed, which I don't really quite understand, but it's you, know, you can change it up quite a bit. Like these are all facing one direction. And then if you go here, they're mixed up. But really easy. So let's go back to the other one and just take this one and do this and save it as an SVG. And I've already saved it. Go to Corel. You don't even have to import it. You can open it and just open, you know, remember what it's called and you could probably name it somehow. I will put a link to this at the bottom of the video for everybody to use. It's a pretty cool site and you can see they're already, the lines are already there and I think it's even gonna cut good because it's got blue lines and red lines. So if you wanna select it all, it's got several outlines, just double click on it, go to red. Maybe let's change the point to hairline first and then go to red. Wow, it's not letting me change it to red. Why is it letting me change it to, there we go. And then you have red hairline cutout and it is good, it's clean. Uh, you know, the pieces are, you know, they don't have any leaks. And if, what I was saying about the cutting, I think this line will cut all by itself and then it'll go back and cut these lines. So it'll even cut pretty quick. So look at the bottom of the video for the link to it. And hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.